Hi. Hi, hello. Oh my God, Mum, literally, you know, I'm a nervous person, but I am absolutely bricking it. Getting some last minute words of encouragement. You know what, Christopher? This could be the man of your dreams. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you make me cry. <laughs> Is 34-year-old salon owner, Chris. I've got such an array of clientele, from, like, dominatrix to standard housewives to people having affairs. Hairdressers is, like, gossip central. You're going to love it, I'm sure of it. I'll settle for a nice guy for now. I'm sure you'll get on, like, a house on fire. I hope so. My favourite thing is, like, a massive makeover. Somebody comes in with, like, utterly crap hair glass of Prosecco in front of them, and then just, like, smash out an amazing hairstyle, and then you walk out like a mermaid. And no show it, you... <laughs> <laughs> I don't get why I'm single. I'm a really outgoing person, but I find it really hard to talk to men. I always get told I'm unapproachable. But I, I'm not. I'm, like, probably one of the sweetest people you'll meet. Love you. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. <sighs> I'm at a point in my life now where I want to start a family. And time's ticking for me. It's important for me to find someone that I can like, spend the rest of my life with. It's something that I think about every single day. You look amazing! Wow! <laughs> well, I do. Unbelievable! When I see people, like all my friends, like, they've all got babies, and I'm single. <laughs> you got a lot of tattoos. I do. Do you have any tattoos? Yeah, I've got a butterfly and a pin-up, but that's it, like... Yeah, I, like, I love tattoos, like, it's an expression of, like... you got one on your face. Does that mean you've been in prison? Mm-hmm. Does that mean you've, like, killed someone or something? Yeah. <laughs> My ex-boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> but you were married. I was married for seven years, to the day almost. Oh, really? The... Happy anniversary. <laughs> Yay, thank you. <laughs> Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> so, almost divorced. I should be over and done with this year. Okay. When I first met my ex husband, we had like a connection. Like, we just we fell in love like almost instantly. And like within 18 months, we were engaged and everything was perfect. I idolized him, I loved him. But then we were young at like 23, 24. You don't really know who you are or what you're looking for in life. I wanted to progress, but I felt that he wanted to stay where he was. I want children, he didn't, so it was a massive thing for us. Oh, is that why you split up? It was one of the reasons why. I've always had, like, a massive paternal instinct. I'm always drawn to children, children love me. It's not just, like, a pipe dream or something that like, I want, it's, it's in me. Like, I know I'm meant to be a dad. I haven't got this big heart for nothing. How old are you again? 30. You're 30? Yeah. So I can't imagine you want kids, yeah? No, I definitely want kids. Aww. I love kids. Really? Yeah, 100%, yeah. That's nice, that's nice. It's a piece of a you. Piece of you. And yeah. see something that's like you, like, growing up. How would you work that, though? So it'd be like, there's an egg, and, like, your lemonade, my lemonade, who's gonna make the baby? Um, I think it's just say, look, you want, let's have two kids. I'd be like, well, mine goes first. <laughs> no, 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 no. I get first dibs on the egg. <laughs>